locks really strong. Won't be able to pick this.
Requesting backup.
going down. Lower level. Locks really strong. Imagine a future among the stars. Imagine a vault. A thrilling. Won't be able to pick this. Imagine hundreds of colonies spread throughout the galaxy and beyond. And with Vault Tech's cutting edge science and technology, you can rest assured that your colony will have the resources to face any challenge. Frontier Colony in the year 2291. Baked by the unrelenting sun. No way I could pick this. This remote, desolate world is all but impossible. Join us on a journey into the future, where humanity has set out on a new voyage of discovery, seeking adventure among the stars.
won't be able to pick this. Spacious private school. Equip all the comforts. No way I could pick this. Enjoy a rich, varied diet. science and technology, you can rest assured that your colony will have resources to face any challenge. Identify yourself.
Thanks. That feels a lot better. I know this may sound like a strange question, but tell me, what do you think about Scribe Halen? She's as dedicated as they come. Real team player. I couldn't agree more. But I wasn't looking for an evaluation of her performance as a scribe. I wanted to know what you thought of Halen as a person. And dance. If you have the time to talk now, I'd still like to know what you think about Scribe Halen. She's as dedicated as they come. Real team player. I couldn't agree more, but I wasn't looking for an evaluation of her performance as a scribe. I want. Uh huh. This isn't like you, Dance. Are you going to tell me what this is all about? I suppose I'm beating around the bush because I don't normally find these discussions easy to handle. I'll try and get right to the point. The truth is, I'm worried about her. Since you and I are getting along so well, I felt like I could confide in you about it, to get your honest opinion. I appreciate that you value my opinion so highly. Tell me what's on your mind. Let me explain everything from the beginning. A few months before you found us, one of my men was shot multiple times by raiders. Halen stayed by that knight's side for two days straight, without sleep, fighting to keep him alive. But he was on a slow decline. I decided that his suffering needed to end, and ordered Halen to administer an overdose of painkillers so he could die with dignity, even though I'm certain she wanted to continue fighting for that knight's life. She injected him without question. It sounds like she was simply following your orders. Of course she was. Halen's never been insubordinate. But the decision whether or not to ease that soldier's suffering isn't the point here. The point is what happened later that same evening. Halen approached me while I was on watch. She didn't say a word, but I could tell something was wrong. After what felt like an eternity, she collapsed into my arms, crying. I didn't know what to do, so I just held her for a while. A few minutes later, she stopped, kissed me on the cheek, and simply said, thank you, before heading back into the police station. Right then, it hit me. Maybe I pushed her too hard. I ordered her to ignore her instincts, to do something her medical training told her was wrong. That's why I'm worried about her, and for that matter, Everyone under my command. Halen will be fine. It's you that I'm worried about. Me? I see what you're getting at. I guess I never thought of it that way. Look, four soldiers. Over half of my team are gone. Each one of them died because of decisions that I made. I understand the risks that come with the job. We all do. But how can anyone have confidence in me anymore? Hell. How can I have confidence in myself? Would it make you feel better if I told you that I believed in you? Actually, it does. Well, it looks like things have taken a turn. I signed up to be your sponsor, so I teach you everything that I know. But it looks like I'm the one that needed the lesson today. All joking aside, I'm pleased that we had this discussion. And with all the problems you're facing, you still took the time to listen. It's comforting to know that I can speak to you as more than just your commanding officer. Does this mean you'd be there to hold me if I ever needed it? I... Uh, I don't know. I, I never thought you'd ask me something like that. It would depend on the circumstances, but 
I suppose we'll just have to see what happens when the time comes. Anyway, thanks for letting me get that off my shoulders. I think it's been weighing on me more than I realized. I'm only sorry you had to see me at my worst, instead of at my best. Cadets, report to the launch bay. Cadets, to the launch bay.
Matrix.
Aim for their weak spot. Calculating chance of success, 20%. 